Cody? Did you make your very own lava lamp? Wow, Odie! Look at all those bubbles! Odie, can you show us how you made your lava lamp? The first thing we need is some water. We are going to pour a little bit in a jar. Next, we are going to add some food coloring. Odie, which color are you going to pick? The red one? Good choice! Let's add a few drops to the water. And stir it. Now let's add some oil. The last thing we are going to do is add an antacid tablet to the oil and water mixture. Want to find out how your lava lab works? There are two steps to this experiment. The first process is the oil and water. When oil and water are added together, they do not mix. No matter how much you stir or shake it, they will always separate. This is because the molecules in the water and the molecules in the oil don't bond with each other. Oil is also less dense than water. This is why it floats on top of the water. The second step is the antacid tablets. The antacid reacts with the water and produces carbon dioxide gas bubbles. Some of the water sticks to the bubbles. Because the bubbles are less dense than both the water and the oil, they rise to the top. Once the bubbles reach the top, they pop. The carbon dioxide is released into the air and the water from the bubbles sinks back to the bottom. Nice work, Odie!